But let me just cast your mind back to five months ago. And that was when I addressed this Board of Trade in this very hotel when we launched the BC Law Jobs Plan, and we called it Canada Starts Here. Since then, every single minister in my government has been focused like a laser beam on making sure that our jobs plan comes to fruition. Because our number one priority is protecting and creating jobs for BC families. And the 2012 BC budget is the cornerstone of our jobs plan. Kevin Falcon has been at the helm of the budget process in what I think we can all agree is one of the most challenging times any of us can imagine. The world economy is vibrating with volatility. But he has kept a watchful eye on British Columbia, and he has ensured that we chart a different course, one that is embedded in stability and prudence. We've got three levels of prudence in this budget. We've got our contingencies, which help us manage unforeseen uh, pressures that may come up or priorities that we may want to achieve. We've got our forecast allowances that are built into this budget going forward, and we've got very conservative economic assumptions. And for all of us, what that means is that British Columbia will maintain its AAA credit rating, it will maintain its reputation as a place in which you want to do business, and it will be in stark contrast to those voices out there that want to go down the road of the European countries, that want to say that actually the answer is spend more, borrow more, tax more, and pretend that it's not going to have any impact in the economy. And that's not the kind of province we want to have in British Columbia. We want a province that will grow with confidence, with investments, with security of knowing that they have a government that wants to grow the economy, make this place safe for families, grow families, grow opportunities, and create a bright future. Thank you very much, ladies and gentlemen.